Yo, what is good, y'all? You do what I'm saying? And welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger for you, J.I. Squad. Now, in today's video, as you guys can see by the title and the thumbnail, we're going to be fixing something that Chevy just didn't do on this car, and I'm really upset about it. So, as you guys saw, um, I recently picked up this 2021 Camaro SS1LE, and it is a 1LE. But the only thing is, there's barely any 1LE branding on it. There's only the 1LE branding on the calipers, and then you know by the satin black hood, the satin black uh, 1LE spoiler, the front splitter, and the satin black diffuser that it's a 1LE, and then obviously the wheels. But that's literally it. There's no other branding at all. So in today's video, we will be fixing that. So let's go ahead, with the help of my boy Back to the Money, Let's go ahead and get this 1LE branded. And all right, guys, if you guys haven't been up to date with all of the videos, I'm going to give you a quick walk around of the car. This is Vader, the 2021 Camaro SS1LE. You dig what I'm saying? And as you guys can see, oh, also, you know, by the black SS badging as well. I forgot about that. But as you guys can see, you know what I'm saying, 2021 1LE. But there's nothing that says 1LE other than the four piston bambos in the rear and the six piston Brembo's in the front. So, today we're gonna be fixing that with this right here. Got some, two, got two badges. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna be debadging the Camaro shield, which is, you know, it's cool and all, but it's just not that. You know what I'm saying? And adding the one LE on the fender literally it's going to sit literally exactly where the camaro shield was at and i feel like that's just going to be perfect way better than that so you should be using a heat gun for this but i don't have a heat gun <laughs> with me at the moment um so what we're going to do is we're going to try to see if we can get it off with the panel priors, one of those little plastic priors, and you'll see, my boy Money said he's done it before, so we'll see if we can get it off. I don't think that the adhesive should be too, like, you know what I'm saying, settled in because it's a 2021. So hopefully we'll be able to get it off like I did the spoiler on Reaper um, without any problems and then, you know, clean up the area and we can go ahead and lay the one LE badges on there and it'll look way better. And then you'll know like when it's coming down the road this ain't just the regular degular you feel me this is like the legit you know what i'm saying the, the this is the upper echelon the track package you know what i'm saying put some respect on it you feel me all right y'all you know what i'm saying got my boy back to the money and the kids up man y'all make sure y'all go tap in with my brother got some stuff brewing and cooking and whipping in the pizza you know i'd rather have my brother do it just in case something goes wrong i have to have somebody to blame <laughs> other than myself you know I won't feel as bad. It was just like the stain. And majority of that shit came off. Bad. Bad. Just like I said, y'all. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. All right, let's go do the other side. I just probably just clean them up now. Nice. You want to take the SS off too? No. You really want me to do that, bro? Like, no. <laughs> yeah, nah. it's, it's not happening, sir. Yeah, that's that's going to look a whole lot better. Yeah. yeah. All right, y'all. Just want to give y'all a quick little update. For the most part, got all of that goo off. Just got to clean the entire surface, of course. Just use this rubber wheel right here. Shout out to my boy Money. His rubber wheel with the drill. Quick little impact. Just finished the driver's side. As y'all see, there's a little bit of gunk left, but I'm just gonna clean up the entire area really good. And then we'll go ahead and start laying down the one LE badges, man. Let me see, look at them six pistons, boy. Sheesh. All right, y'all, so I just got the fender all prepped. Use some rubbing alcohol just to clean the surface a little bit, get it ready. This is the one that I use right here. Now we finna grab the first badge and go ahead and get ready to lay it down. Alright y'all, so when you take it out of the package, like the little plastic, it's basically like on this film, 
inside of the housing. So what I'm gonna try to do is peel the film back and still use the foam housing to make sure that they're all straight. Cause it's not like all one piece, they're all separate letters. So hopefully I can use like the little housing to line it up straight. Just peel back the little protectives. Okay, Mr. 1LE, 